Project 3 Working with Wood and Bamboo Notes and Summary from Grade 8 Subject Vocational Education Book Kaushal Both Introduction Wood and Bamboo are natural materials that play an important role in our daily lives. From furniture, doors, windows, benches, and kitchen tools to toys and artworks, wood and bamboo are everywhere. This project helps students learn basic carpentry skills, measuring, cutting, joining, shaping and finishing, to make useful products and understand how natural materials can be used sustainably. Students will learn about different types of wood and bamboo, understand safe tool handling, make creative and functional products, explore sustainability and cost management in woodworking. What will I be able to do? By the end of this project, you will be able to safely use carpentry tools like a hammer, saw and drill, design and make a prototype of a product, build and assemble a functional wooden or bamboo object, apply finishing techniques like sanding and varnishing. What will I need? Tools required, tri square, hand saw, wood file, plane, claw hammer, measuring tape and steel ruler, bench vise, clamps, hand drill, brush and cutter, materials required, nails, screws and wood glue, sandpaper, soft wood or bamboo, varnish or paint, synthetic resin adhesive, cellophane tape, cardboard for prototypes. How do I keep myself and others safe? First, handling tools, hold the tools properly and use them safely, wear masks and safety goggles to protect from wood dust. Second, workplace safety, keep your area clean and free from sawdust or wood pieces, return tools to their places after use. Third, internet safety, ask your teacher before using the internet, do not share personal information or download anything unsafe. What do I need to know before I start? Types of wood, hardwood, babul, mango, jackfruit, teak, used for furniture and building, softwood, pine, deodar, used for shelves and packing boxes, eucalyptus, used for making paper. Next, sustainability, wood is renewable only if trees are replanted. Bamboo is a fast growing grass and regrows quickly making it eco-friendly. Engineered wood like plywood and MDF can also be used as an alternative. Fingernail test. Press your nail on the wood. If it leaves a mark, soft wood. If not, hard wood. Activity 1. Visit a local woodworking bamboo workshop. Visit a carpenter's workshop and observe what types of products are made what tools and wood types are used, how they cut, join and polish wood, what safety precautions they follow, record your findings in a table, type of work, wood used, tools and techniques, safety methods. Activity 2. Understanding bamboo or wooden products. Select any wooden or bamboo object near you. Example a bench or a chair. Observe. Type of material used. Number of parts, type of joints used, butt joint, lap joint, miter joint, mortise and tenon joint. Whether screws, nails or hinges are used, draw a simple sketch and label each part. Activity 3. Making a prototype of a desired object or product. A prototype is the first model of your product made from cardboard or waste soft wood. It helps check design accuracy before making the final product. Steps First, sketch the design with dimensions. Second, mark the design on cardboard or softwood. Third, cut and assemble the parts using glue or tape. Fourth, renew and modify the design based on feedback. Activity 4. Making a product from wood. Now make your final wooden product using softwood or plywood. Start with simple items such as coaster, key holder, wall hanging, 
phone stand, name plate, wooden toy, basic carpentry steps, first sketching and planning, draw the object and gather tools, second measuring and marking, mark dimensions with a scale and pencil, third cutting, use a hacksaw and keep wood fixed in a bench wise, fourth planing and sanding, smooth the surface for neat finishing, fifth assembly, joint parts with glue, nails or screws, sixth varnishing, painting, apply a coat for shine and protection. Activity 5. Make a bamboo product. Bamboo is strong and light, ideal for eco-friendly products. The cull, main stem of bamboo is usually used. Steps. First, sketch and measure. Draw the design and label dimensions. Second, cutting. Cut bamboo using a hacksaw. Third, smoothening. Scrape and sand the surface. Fourth, assembly. Use nails or screws to join pieces. Fifth, varnishing, painting. Apply finishing for beauty and strength. You can make a bamboo pen stand, flower vase, wind chime, small basket, bamboo lamp shade. Activity 6. Costing. How much did you spend? Calculate the total cost of your product. So friends, you have to create a table like this. Materials used, wood, bamboo, nail screws, paint, varnish, sandpaper, other materials. Then in second column, quantity, third column, cost per item in rupees and fourth column, total cost in rupees. Compare your cost with similar products in the market. Activity 7. Basic repairs around the school. Use your carpentry skills to repair small things like tightening screws on benches, fixing cupboard doors, sending worn out parts, repainting wooden items. Example, repair task, loose bench top, fixed properly, yes, how, tightened screws, any improvements needed, smoothened edges using sandpaper. What did I learn? Learned tool usage and safety measures. Understood design, measurement and joining methods. Practiced patience, teamwork and precision. Learned to repair and reuse wood, helping reduce waste. Time management. Record how many periods you took for each activity, 1 to 7. This helps track how much time each task required. What else can I do? You can make musical instruments from wood or bamboo like Ektara, one stringed instrument, bamboo flute, made from hollow bamboo with holes, damaru, small double drum, clappers and bells, simple rhythm instruments. You can also reuse old wood to make new items like shelves or art pieces. Summary This project teaches how to work safely with wood and bamboo, use carpentry tools and techniques, design and make prototypes, create functional and creative products, calculate cost and repair wooden items, understand the value of sustainability and craftsmanship, wood and bamboo work connects creativity, tradition and skill, helping students become resourceful and environmentally responsible creators. So friends, we have completed notes and summary of project 3, working with wood and bamboo. We will do question answers of this chapter in a separate video. If you like the video, kindly like, hype the video and share it with your friends. Also subscribe to my channel for more such videos. We will meet in the next video. Thank you for watching.